Okay, I want to be very quick because McLovin is actually on his way. I want to do an experiment, but what I did was I purchased a 55-inch 4K Ultra HD TV. It's a Vizio. Uh, it's the E-Series. I'll have the, let's see, yeah, that's the model number right there. Uh, and I purchased it for 420 bucks at Sam's. Great deal. It was a one-day sale. I had to pick one up. It was just, it was just too good to resist. And you get that 4K and 55 inches. Needless to say, it was a great buy. Now McLovin is going to be gaming on this TV right here, which we know is, you know, most TVs are notorious for input lag. And then we're gonna have him game on a 144 hertz 1440p Pixio monitor, which should be much better than the TV. Now Jacob's relatively new to PC gaming. Uh, we just built his PC a couple days ago actually if you're interested in that series you can check it out right here uh, but I want to see without telling him what what will happen before he plays if he notices that input lag uh, that's something that people who play PC games uh, quite a bit already know about if you swap from something like a monitor to a TV just in general you'll notice the the lag time if you tell your character to move left it will take a noticeably longer amount of time for that character to move left on a TV than in a monitor. So with that, uh, let's let's start setting things up. He's about to walk in, and then uh, we'll we'll let him take it from there. Yeah, I'll get you a controller. All right, Jacob. Button. Yeah, playing some video games. <laughs> right? Yeah, you're playing video games. Yeah. Okay, so we have the computer. <laughs> hooked up to the 55 inch 4K TV. Shout out to Vizzy over this awesome remote. Look at this what remote. <laughs> I have never seen a more pitiful remote. There, there, there aren't even arrows on the TV, on the remote. Look at that. You get, that's, that's more basic than. It's like know. Super Mario Nintendo 64, except on a Vizio. Like it doesn't even slide out either. There's no keyboard, there's nothing. Oh, you set up the Pharaoh wrong. Oh, this is weird. <laughs> this is really weird. Like, it's so trippy. <laughs> like, it's so much more. Oh, oh, oh. I'm normally really good at this, but apparently I'm not. I can't wait to get on the other screen. It's so dang big. It's so touchy. Feeling it? Oh, pop, pop. Wow. Oh, look, it's already. Oh, it's back up to 60. Alright, turn up. Ooh, that is way better. That is way better. Okay, so Jacob has uh, just started playing Black Ops 3 for the first time ever, ever. on a 144 hertz monitor. And uh, Jacob, I want your raw impressions while you're playing. What do you, what do you think? I mean, it's, it's the best like screen I've ever played on. It's so touchy. This is just so responsive. I mean, everything about it. So we just switched oh our sensitive. Oh my gosh. <laughs> uh, uh. So, so would you say in, the, in this scenario, it would be better to have a, uh, a, a lower sensitivity yeah. on a higher oh refresh rate monitor? Oh my goodness. Oh, dude. Is this better oh, or worse? Hive, baby. Are you feeling it? Oh, little spray out action. <laughs> but no, this is like, I mean, this is like, this is so good. It just seems so easy to like, it's so fluent. Fluent, Jesus. Fluent, Jacob. Fluent, fluid. Good God. Can't even get that right. Uh oh, there's a lot more than I expected. So what were the differences? What did you notice with the TV compared to that of the monitor? What were the differences there? I mean like the lag time, it's like, it just frustrates lag me. Lag time, what do you mean by that? Whenever I like, just with movement, it seems that I would actually hit the analog stick in one direction and you can just, it hesitates, you can tell that it's taking its time. So by the time I can react, I'm already dead. With the computer monitor, it's like instantaneous. It's as soon as I start to move, it's reacting. So I can actually play as fast as I can move my fingers. As far as the TV, you have to like second guess yourself because everything is so slow that you have to like make a second decision. With the monitor, it's like you, it's just instantaneous. You can just sit there and you know if you're gonna take a right, you're gonna move right then. You don't have to like second guess yourself. Um, now, how did you feel about playing on a smaller screen versus a larger one for that kind of game? I personally like smaller screens. I always have. How do so. you perform in first person shooters with a small screen versus a large one? Well, way better. Way better. So smaller screens are actually oh, beneficial yeah. for those oh, kinds yeah. of games. When, uh, um, back when I played Black Ops 1, um, I actually bought a Vizio 32 inch and it was too big. So I actually went back to a really crappy 19 inch, um, really crappy TV. And it was just, it's so much easier to like play on. And that's what I went through all of high school. 
So the 55 inch is, a, is definitely a no for Black Ops 3. Yeah. Definitely. I mean, just like the lag time was just like ridiculously crappy. It's like by the time I actually started to move, like I'm already like, oh crap, I, I know I'm gonna die. Like, you know, that's like, oh, okay, yep, there it comes. Like, just it just it frustrates me that it takes so long for it to respond, although we're in milliseconds. Mm -hmm. milliseconds like, yeah. milliseconds, it's just so aggravating. It's noticeable. You, yeah. yeah, you can just sit there and you tell that you're like, if this was a little bit quicker, or if it responded faster, I could have killed him. Mm -hmm. Which, if you're a gamer, you know, it's like the most frustrating thing ever. I've rage quitted a bunch of times before, so let me tell you. So Jacob, here's something I didn't uh, I didn't tell you before. I mean, I didn't tell you about the response time issue. I wanted to see what you thought of both before I actually told you what would happen. Uh, because I already knew the TV would be the, the less... The, the 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 less desirable of the two it's garbage but here's <laughs> but here's the here's the thing that that i didn't tell you you can purchase both of those screens back there for about the same price i haven't actually gone out and bought a computer monitor because i thought my tv monitor would do just as fine but now that i've personally gone through both and seen what a computer monitor can do compared to a tv I'm just gonna go put the TV back and just go buy a computer monitor. I think it's funny when you pulled up when you when you turned on the 4K TV and started playing with it. You, you, I mean, it, it it's a big screen, so I think that was that was part of the yeah. issue. But you didn't really complain much about the lag time, which may, which leads me to assume that you were kind of already used to it. No, I'm, that's all I'm used to is that <laughs> lag time. So whenever I switched over to the monitor, it just amazes me that I'm not having to deal with other electronics that I'm already having to deal with crappy internet connection. So that's one thing that pisses me off. And then another thing that kind of pisses me off is when I know that I'm moving the joysticks, but it's not responding how I need it to, I can actually play the game of how fast I can react. So I don't have to like wait for the TV to react. It's my reaction time. It's that quick. So if I'm moving the joystick, it's moving with how fast I'm moving it. Everything is just so fluid. It's ridiculous. It's I mean, it's next to none. I mean, that TV monitor I've had in my house, I'm probably gonna trash. <laughs> it's just such garbage compared to this. <laughs> now that and, you've seen the light. <laughs> yeah, I mean, and I think Greg's right. Like, I'm used to the reaction time of a TV. So when I got onto the TV, I probably didn't complain because it's like, yeah, I'm used to like really crappy <laughs> reaction time or lag time. So actually playing on a computer monitor was just, I mean, it's the amount of reaction time and just how quick it can react is incredible. Just the fluidity. Fluidity? Oh my God. Fluidity, diddity. <laughs> it's just so much clearer. That's a wrap folks. Thanks for watching. Like I said, I kind of expected him to say something like that, but uh, that's it. If you play first person shooters, especially you will notice the lag associated with a TV. And if you play with something like a gaming monitor, this Pixio monitor behind us, 144 Hertz refresh rate, four millisecond response time. And uh, Jacob's head's kind of in the way. And a 1440p resolution, as long as you have the horsepower to drive those frames, you will have a very enjoyable first person shooter experience. So, Does my, uh, my uh, PC gonna support this? You, I want you, 144 hertz 4K. Yeah, check out his video right here. Folks, let me know if you think that computer will uh, will support a 1440p. I already read the reviews. It's not. <laughs> Everyone's making fun of it. So it doesn't matter. It's oh, an editing rig. Don't forget, Cheap editing we rig. are going to be bringing you new footage of gaming. That's right. We are bringing back our high school days, and we're going to take you with us. That's right. <laughs> I'm talking Black Ops 1, Guitar Hero. Grand Theft Auto, <laughs> and other stuff. So sit back and relax, because we're going to do it for you. And what's the name boy. of that channel, Jacob? It's called Entertainment Studio. Oh. Um, oh. Who came up with that name? Kind of both of us. Uh, Greg kind of thought of it first, because, you know, the studio is going to be incorporated. Not hey, the man. club and the panhandle. Part of the Salazar now. Studio franchise, bro. But um, we will be uploading footage actually very shortly. And um, oh, you're so nice. Try to bring you great footage of me owning Greg on possibly when I go out and buy a new computer monitor to replace my TV. Tell you what, Jacob, we'll see if Pixio will send you one. Oh, yeah, Pixio sent me one, bro. Yeah, Pixio, hook Jacob up. Hook me up, Pixio. I'll like, I'll. I'll do a, like a montage video of how good it looks. I'll just like, oh, uh, Pixio, send me your monitor. I want one really bad. I mean, trust me, I've gamed for 13 years and that was the best experience I've ever had. No, I'm not, I didn't tell you to say this, right? No. Pixio didn't tell us to say any of this stuff. No, I mean, I really, the, the, no. 
It's, it's, it's really incredible. I mean, actually, well, also, Greg's PC is, like, next to none, so... Yeah. I'm sure mine may be able to support how much I want it to, but just the reaction they will, they time. Won't. <laughs> no, of course not. Why would I think that? But the reaction time was incredible. I need one. Like, I need one. Like, I'll even send you like a little bumper sticker that says McLovin the Panhandle. I'm gonna have to like special order that because I don't have any of those. So just think of yourself special. I'll even like put my like signature on it. I'll say Pixio, thanks. Is it French? It sounds French. This is Science Studio. Uh, make sure to sub oh. wow. Make sure to subscribe. Uh, Wait, down. Let's redo this. Okay. Okay. Start from the beginning, Jacob. Uh, this is Science Studio. No, uh, you, you don't say that to the very end. What am I saying now? Give this video a thumbs up. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, uh, give this video a thumbs up if you thought it was good, or give it a thumbs down if you think the complete opposite or you hate everything about life. Uh, thanks for learning with us. <laughs> no, you jumped the gun. <laughs> subscribe. <laughs> subscribe down. I'm trying to think of where it would be. Right there. It's going to be over there. Yep. Over here. Yep. Stop, stop. 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 Over there. Um, <laughs> make sure to watch out for new content on Sign Studio. Oh, oh that's... Yeah. Uh, McLovin the Panhandle. Yeah, McLovin the you Panhandle. I'm not edit that out. I'm not gonna... <laughs> And then uh, the new... Um, the new YouTube channel coming out called Entertainment Cha Studio. Oh, my Entertainment God. Studio. Um, that should be coming out very shortly. Actually, um, we're we're gonna attempt my PC. It's probably not gonna handle the amount of awesomeness I'm gonna be pumping out of it, but we're gonna check that out. Um, yeah, and this is McLovin signing off with Science Studio. Thanks for <laughs> thanks for learning with us, Bill Nye.